Hello everyone, this is a quick video about how to add timecode to vMix. Uh, there are a couple things that you're going to need to be able to do this. First off, I have a uh, Focusrite 2i2 interface. Um, you're going to need a similar uh, interface with an XLR input. As well as uh, this program here called uh, Timecode Monitor by Timecode Sync, which I have running here. Uh, now there's a couple things that you're going to have to set up with the Timecode Monitor. Uh, first off, you're going to have to go into configure, and I've noticed that this works best with a 44-1 sample rate uh, at uh, 70, 768 samples or more buffer size, which does add a little bit of, of uh, delay to your time code, but that's about one frame. So there we go. Uh, we want to make sure that we have our interface selected here, left channel if it's in channel 1 right channel if it's in channel two. And then if you have a focus right, uh, I'm not sure for other uh, for other interfaces, but with my focus right down in my tray here, I have an icon for my focus right. I'm gonna right click that and I wanna take a look at Scarlet 2i2 settings. This little window right here is where I'm gonna set a few parameters. I'm gonna make sure my sample rate is matching. Uh, my buffer size in here, I want to have as low as possible. Um, this is a buffer size for the timecode app itself. This is a buffer size for the focus right and its processing. So we want to make this as low as possible, which 16 is my lowest setting. Uh, like I said, 768 seems to be working state stably for me on my end here. And I'm going to go ahead and close that menu and just let that run. Now back in vMix, uh, I've already set this up, but I'm going to set an input desktop capture and that is going to be that window specifically timecode monitor and that's just going to pop up in your uh, in your inputs just like this did here and then i'm going to go ahead and close that and so within my input i can go over here and go to position and i'm just going to crop around the edges and clean this uh timecode clock up a little bit and just trim it down so it's right around my digits and then now that I've grabbed that pretty good there, I'm going to go over to my color key. I'm going to select uh, this uh, this kind of gray black that's around my digits. And then that's going to leave me with just my numbers. And close. And now that I have that, I can uh, take a look at it on a background and see that I still kind of have a little bit of trimmings in there I can clean up. So I'm going to go back into my position. I'm going to crop my X a little bit more. That cleans that, and then we'll do the same here. And there we go, looking good. Oh, I still have a little bit there. There we go, and I just got rid of uh, that little bit of, uh, of ugliness that we had on the bottom there. I could also adjust that in my color key, but I found it just a little, I found it just a little bit easier just for this one to just trim that out with the uh, cropping tools. And now wherever I want to add this in, um, I can use it right now. I just have it as an overlay in my multi view for my sync graphic positioned up in the top right. Uh, let me put that back. Uh, reset the position there. And then I have it set as overlay 10 right now and I can just put that wherever I'd like. And I can also do that with my uh, with my main overlays if I'd like. Uh, but for these purposes, this is okay. And then what I could do is I can go to add input here. I can go to NDI desktop capture, capture my uh, main output from vMix. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just copy from, since I already have this set in my sync graphic, I'll just copy my overlays from there and close that. Go over here, turn off my clock, and then now I have a clean output of vMix that I can record with no timecode. And then I have uh, another version of my output here with a timecode clock. And in the multi-quarter, I can record that as well as my output and have those in parallel. There you go. I hope this helps somebody out. And uh, good luck and happy vMixing.